Sensory cooking exists to allow people, especially those with ASD, the opportunity to engage with food, not just cook. All of our senses need to be involved to create amazing foods and experiences while cooking. Food isn't just about eating, but about loving all the aspects of food preparation that ties meals together. When Nicholas was younger, I would watch him in the kitchen, and for a kid who didn't smile a lot, baking cookies seemed to make him happy. When I took pictures of him cooking, the smiles were genuine. He was beginning to love food, not just eating it, but being with it, enjoying the smells and sights and even the sounds of the kitchen. Realizing that this was important to Nicholas, we started to notice other kids on the spectrum also loved cooking. We tried several ways to create cooking classes for our autism group without success. We spoke with different people who specialized in cooking classes, but they were always too busy. We called cooking schools to discuss possibilities for special needs classes, but they just acted like I was crazy. That has happened more than once in our venture to create what our child on the spectrum and so many others need. In the same way, we have been creating social opportunities for the past 10 years through Kids with Autism Can. We will now be creating some awesome cooking and sensory experiences through our new business, Sensory Cooking. Sensory Cooking has several different aspects with a variety of purposes. These include small social cooking groups that provide life skills, and social and language opportunities. Cooking meals will bring friends and families together. My kids say I know all of their friends based on the foods they like, and it's so true. Food is a great way to get to know people and their likes and dislikes, and maybe find out how conservative or adventurous they are. Also, full-length videos give people on the spectrum language and sensory goals. The food preparation in the videos will be paced and deliberate to allow for people to follow along regardless of skill levels. Mini clips provide lots of little food ideas that do not require cooking a full meal. It's a great way to introduce new food ideas in short clips so we can start to hold people's attention if they aren't ready for a full length recipe. Individual cooking classes are an opportunity for anyone to embrace all the different sensory aspects of food and cooking. We look forward to adding more options as we grow. We are creating great opportunities for people to engage all of their senses. Cooking is an important life skill. You need to be able to eat something other than a peanut butter sandwich. Most people are more invested in eating something they have prepared. All that being said, let's start cooking. For more information, go to www.sensorycooking.net.